Um, there are plenty of other stocks as well that are in the green this morning. Siemens on the back of that 26,000 crore contract. APL Apollo tubes as well. Keep an eye out on Just Dials. All of these stocks in focus. That's the first rate that you're seeing on your screens, which is in the green. Mild green, actually. 17,900 on the Nifty. The mid-cap index is up about 52 odd points and just pivot, you know, sort of moving around that 17,900 mark. The bank nifty is dragging its feet a tad bit, nothing alarming. But a couple of these stocks do deserve mention on the upside. HUL is your big mover, it comes out with numbers this week, so up six tenths of a percent. Reliance is your big mover ahead of numbers on Friday, up about half a percent. There's Aisha Motors, LNT, Apollo Hospitals, UPL, and Divi's Labs that are also trending in the green by a tad bit, you'd have to say. On the downside, uh, once again, it's metals that's under a bit of pressure. Tata Steel, JSW Steel are in the red. Bajaj Finance is down about six tenths of a percent. Hindalco is down about eight tenths of a percent. So metal stands out as the loser. And then you have a couple of these auto stocks. Hero, Bajaj Auto are in the red this morning. TCS is also dragging its feet a tad bit. And so is Power Grid. But otherwise, you'd have to say it's a very, very quiet start to trade. Uh, in the broader markets, of course, a couple of stocks, uh, you know, you have Kesoram, which is down 4%, Nika is under pressure, uh, Sula continues to move up with quite a bit of strength, but from the frontliners, it's very, very quiet, just marking time around that 17,900. Well, that's right, so, uh, Sonia, you know, you had Sambada and Madhusan as well, uh, there's a large entity out there that's looking to sell close to 1.5% stake via block deal, so that's down close to around a percent, I think, the last time I checked, so keep an eye on that one. Ashoka Bilkon, they've announced, uh, you know, November 19th, this commercial operation date for a ham project. Angel One is reacting to its numbers. The margins improved by closer to 100 basis points odd. And the other few names, you know, whether it's Kesaram, Tinplate and JSW, Ispath, all of them are reacting to its numbers. On a year-on-year basis, the numbers were quite disappointing. Uh, but uh, on a sequential basis, there was some improvement. Kesaram, though, the street is a little bit skittish on what is the financial position. Are they making their payments on time? I think that's why that stock is down closer to around 5.5% as we speak. Uh, the Nifty that opened up in the green, while well, it's moved to a more or less flattish terrain, the Nifty Bank is pulling back a little bit, down closer around 100 points on. Prashant. Uh, Nigel, thanks for that. I mean, you know, it's like a, a, a traffic light, right? Blinking red and green, uh, absolutely flat. Uh, 